Hello. Today I'm going to be making a video about how to calculate an equivalent uniform annual cost. Now what that is, is basically how much it costs to own or maintain an item over the course of some period of time. So in our case, we have a printer whose present value is $900. It has a salvage value of $300 after n equals 5 years and has an interest rate of 8%. So a good way to start off would be to create a cash flow diagram because I it help it can help to visualize what's going on because it shows how much money you've got going into and out of your cash flow. It's the name cash flow diagram. Before I created this video or started recording, I took the liberty of um, making one already. Just because I can't draw very straight lines in this program. But like I said, in terms of its ability to illustrate what's going on, you can see that at year zero when we purchase the printer, we have $900 leaving our cash flow. And then each year after that, at the end of year zero, $50, all the way up until we get to year five where we sell it for $300. So this is our present value. This is our salvage value. Oh, and we also have a maintenance cost of $50. I forgot to add that in. And we're going to calculate how much it costs to own and maintain this printer for the next five years using equations that are going to convert our future and present values into an equivalent value in today's money with the given interest rate. So as you can see before I erased it, this is going to be our present value. So this is going to be the annual cost of our present value and this is going to be the annual cost of our future value. We're also going to define down as positive just because when we do the formulas and plug all the the numbers and such in will end up with a positive value. It's arbitrary, but I you know I like to deal with positive values, I guess. I mean. Anyway, so we have our equivalent uniform annual cost is gonna be equal to present value times our interest times one plus interest to the end over 1 plus interest to the n minus 1 plus our maintenance cost minus our future value so 1 plus i to the n minus 1 over i and the way you can look at this if like the net if the total difference between these is the amount of money that you're going to spend this is the amount of money you've got going out of your cash flow and this is the money you're putting back in to your, to your cash flow. But for the present value and the future value of our initial and our final costs, we're going to want to include the interest rate because that will convert it into our today's money. So. EVAC is going to be equal to 900 times 8 times 9 times 0 8 times 5th over minus 300 times 1.0 which is 4 times 1 0.0 so after you do these calculations, you'll find out that this equals $225.41 plus $50 minus $51.14.
dollars. It gives us a total cost of $224.27 per So this value right here is how much it costs us to own and maintain this printer over the course of five years.